the university library has thousands of books, articles, and other resources waiting to be used by students just like you, but it can be frustrating to set up online access to library resources if you're not familiar with the process. This video will show you a few tips, tricks, and best practices for when you're using the library from a distance. First off, try not to use the library from pause. You'll have limited options when using the library tab in pause, so you're better to go straight to the source, library.usask.ca. Once you're on this website, sign into your library account before doing anything else. Click My Library Account, log into the site, and then you'll be asked for your NCID and password. Next, you'll be able to see your library account. Here you can see recent checkouts, fines if you have any, holds on borrowed items, as well as your borrower information. This tells you your patron type and some of the details about your borrowing limits. To get back to your search, go to University Library at the top of the page. Now you're ready to find some resources. You can select the type of material you want to find by using these tabs on the search box. So if you want books, select books, articles, journals, databases, and more options. So if you want to work on a research paper, perhaps articles is a good place to start. Here you can search for specific articles or search by subject, author, citation, or digital object identifier, or DOI, if you have it. One tip for you, if you're searching for a known article, such as an article on a reading list provided by your professor, simply put the title in this box and enclose it in quotation marks. This will find the exact article you're looking for, rather than picking up specific words from the title that don't lead you quite to the right thing. So let's do a search for nursing theory. In this box, I'm simply going to search nursing and theory. These results are journal articles that contain the words nursing and theory. To access the full text article, simply click full text online. Here, click go to access the full text. You can read this article online, or if you prefer, you can download the PDF If you're working with a citation manager, you're also able to export the citation under Tools and Export Citation. You'll find that most of the articles you want to find are going to be available online. But should you want to access something like a print book or perhaps an older print article, the library does have an option for you. Distance and distributed library services will be covered in our next video. Thanks for watching.